Hi everybody and welcome back to Relax My Dog. Now today is one of my favourite videos ever to film and that is facts about a particular dog breed and today we're going to be focusing on the dog breed Bezinji. I think that's how you pronounce it. No clue. Bezinji. It's a very, very odd word to try and say. Try and say it yourself at home. I think it's Bazinji, but we'll roll with it. Before we do get started though, let me know down below in the comments, do you know any particular facts about this dog breed? Or is there another dog breed that you really, really want to see us do one of these videos on? Because we are always adding new dog breeds to our list. So the first fact is that they go way back. The Bazinji has actually been around for so, so long. They hung out with the ancient Egyptians back in the day. Um, in fact, there was evidence of the dogs existing as far back as 4,000 BCE way back and as well these dogs most likely obviously it's quite hard to try and go all the way back then but they most likely originated from central africa and the second fact is all about that they have been used a lot for sculptures and to be as a muse and they're just like a very very well illustrated and painted dog there is so many different pictures of them out there and in fact in new york's metropolitan museum of art it actually has a bronze statue of a bazinji and their owner which is quite impressive third fact is that they are excellent hunters the bazinji were bred for hunting the canines were used for flushing out animals out of hiding places and into hunters nets and they were also used as well in a lot of villages to try and keep them rodent free as well obviously just the perfect hunting dog the perfect dog to have around the house if you do suffer from a lot of rodents these might be the perfect dog breed to get now fact number four is that they were actually used in africa to lure lions out of their dens and out of their caves which is absolutely mad bazinji isn't that really that big but to be able to get this lion out of its cave is really really impressive now the next fact i think is my favorite fact about this dog breed and that is that their bark isn't really a bark, it's more of a yodel. Now the dogs are actually known to be quite a quiet breed and the fact is they just can't bark. So whenever they do try and make any sort of noise, it just sounds a little bit like a yodel. Now the next fact is that training will not be easy. These dogs love to stand their own ground. They are extremely independent dogs and they are known actually to be quite like cat-like dogs. The fact that a cat will just do what they want, they won't care what their owners are thinking, that is very much like a Bazinji. They will just go out whenever they please, do whatever they want, eat whenever they want. They're quite an independent dog, so trying to train this dog can be quite difficult. And that is it for this week's video. Thank you all so, so much for watching. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to comment down below, and also don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, and you would like to. And me and Milo will see you next week for next week's video. Bye.